This, this is for the hopeless, the harassed, the hurting, and the hurried. Psychologists call you adolescents. It seems like a cold and clinical word for the energy and enthusiasm you bring. The fear and fed up anxiety bundled within you. We know more than a million of you. A million kids who have an influential adult in their lives. A leader who knows their name. Who can, well, lead. A person with two goals, show up and show Jesus. That's all we do. But sociologists tell us there are over a billion of you inhabiting our world. Texting and talking, blundering and bounding your way through life. And while Jesus talked about the 99, we have 999 million of you that we don't yet know. A number that staggers the imagination. We need an army of leaders to pull this off. But if not us, then who? So, so we're, we're going. going. We may be at your football game, your lunchroom, at the bodega, hanging out in the park, hosting a birthday party, or simply walking the neighborhood. You'll see us. We're going where you are. And we'll keep showing up. You'll ask why we're here, if you even talk to us at all. You'll ask what we want. You'll ask if we have friends our own age. <laughs> and we'll keep showing up, one by one. We will invite you to the place at the table. There is an empty chair waiting for you. For the billion of you who feel hopeless or harassed. There are thousands of us who give our free time. That is our time when we could be with our friends or our own age. Or our families. Or doing whatever other grown-ups do. There are thousands more who will join our ranks. We believe in something more. We believe that God, who created the universe, wants us to care for you. He wants you to know him. So, so we show up, up and, and we show Jesus. Jesus. We're making plans to reach all of you. People like us who will give and give and give want to show you there's another way than hopelessness. Or hurt. Or hurry. A way of hope and healing. For all those, for all, for those all of those waiting, we are going.